cuando le cuando le llegó el guión well, you got the script. Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál fue la parte que más te llamó la atención? ¿Cuál fue la escena que más le, que le fue más difícil grabar que más, o que más le caló? ¿Cuál fue la escena 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 que más le caló? Because they, both of them, wanted me to to lose control. Because he's a kind of repressed personality all the time, and this they want me to lose control. And we dance, I think, at least uh, 12 or 13 or 14 or 15 times because of the point of view uh, method of, of uh, shooting. So I, I was, uh, I think. All, it was, uh, the whole day was shot only on this, uh, on this scene. And, uh, it was the most exhausting scene. For me. Usted tiene una trayectoria amplia, reconocido. Eh, ¿Cómo se siente por haber ganado el premio Ophira Mejor Actor de Reparto por esta película? Do you have a lot of experience as an actor? Mm -hmm. How do you feel when you have been awarded with this Captain Price? Um, as, as always, I was very glad to have the, the, the award. But, uh, I mean, uh, it's peculiar. I, I've been awarded many times. Uh, I don't know why exactly, but this time I felt uh, 
very uh, excited more than you uh, because I don't know maybe uh, in Israel I've been awarded I think six years ago for the for the best uh, actor award so maybe the, the lapse of time and also maybe because I'm mature person I can appreciate it and enjoy it. Um, uh, usually I, I, I've been awarded and I, I criticize myself and I say, all right, it's better than award, but you know the truth inside, I was never satisfied completely with my work. Uh, and this, uh, and this award I, I let go and I allow myself to enjoy it. So maybe uh, it's, Very good. it's kind of special and uh, award for me, a special uh, way of me uh, to relate to, the, to this award. ¿Cuál sería su próximo proyecto o qué proyecto de qué papel le gustaría interpretar? What is your next project or what is the part of the role that you would like to interpret? Well, I'm involved in the in cinema, but uh, and mainly in theatre. I work uh, with constantly in theatre. Uh, right now, I'm doing uh, Tartif by Molière. I'm doing uh, one part of it, another French film called uh, Cher Trésor. Um, and I've got many, many, many plans. Uh, I have to do uh, some Shakespeare. Uh, I've done also another film, yeah. uh, Thanks a lot for your time. Uh, uh, and there's some plans for the future. For, uh, there's some scripts uh, waiting for me, for, for me near, near, the, near my bed to be read and to be decided upon. <laughs> Le hemos visto trabajar en varias películas con, con ella, pero ¿qué tal es trabajar con Ronit como directora? Uh, we've seen you in various films with Ronit. How is she as a director? Um, I, 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 first of all, I admire her work as, as an actress. She gets something he, he, that hypnotizes you, like, like a magnet. Uh, so, uh, Wherever I have to work with her, I'm very good. And uh, she was, as a, as a director, she was very precise. And because she, she is an actress herself, she knows uh, what to say and not to, not to, uh, not to say to the actors. Because sometimes uh, uh, an actress director says something. Uh, you say the actor, you tell the actor uh, what to do. And it's so very wrong because uh, in this case they have to do exactly what the director says and, and then, uh, bring something from yourself. Uh, and her, and her uh, work was very uh, delicate and uh, just, uh, I mean, give you, like Shlomi does, uh, the framework and it lets you live inside. They were stubborn in this scene the, about uh, when I when I'm exploding. Um, they, they wanted it again and again uh, until until they got what they wanted. Because they want me to lose control as a, as a, as a character. El abogado de Vivian es un hombre poco religioso, mientras que el abogado Elisha es rabino e intenta e intenta argumentar siempre con razones religiosas. ¿Cree que la película trata también el conflicto entre religión y justicia? Um, Vivian's uh, lawyer is uh, non religious. And you are the uh, religious lawyer and you are a religious. Do you think that the, one of the arguments of the film is the contrast between um, religious, uh, religion and justice? Is there a yen? I think there is a, it's, it's the main issue of the one of the main issues of the film, uh, the confrontation between religion and justice. So it's it's it's, it's for sure uh, for sure justice for him as, as human being. Uh, I mean, the the audience and all the all the people who took part in the film.
can see that this couple can, cannot live together, that it's, it's injustice towards her. But uh, the law protects her. And this is the conflict between uh, the life itself and, and, the, and, the, and the framework of the, of the law that uh, imposed uh, upon her uh, things that is, is not just for her as a human being. Uh, so uh, it's also uh, a fight between tradition, uh, looking at things traditionally uh, according to the law, and the, the modern life and her modern uh, and her willing to be a free person. Uh, because she's a political person, uh, Vivian. Uh, that want uh, to express uh, her freedom in the house and, and, and in, uh, in, in front of the law uh, But the law won't let her. Uh, unfortunately, it's, it's, it's true, the situation is true, like this in Israel. And one of the, 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 the issues of, the, of this film is to, to, to give into awareness the, this uh, situation. I, to make people aware of it and uh, hopefully to change it. Um, in Israel we have uh, a problem of uh, uh, religious religion taking part in, in political uh, decisions. So uh, we, we don't have a separation, a complete separation between religion and, and politics. So uh, because of the, the, the government, the way government is is uh, work because of the politics of uh, uh, and this is one of the main things that the uh, film is talking about, the power that the religion has as a political uh, and um, that influence personal life. ¿Cómo ha sido recibida la película en Israel, en Israel? y cuáles han sido los primeros comentarios que le han llegado? How was this film received or welcomed in Israel? What were the first comments that you heard about the reception of this film in Israel? Um, well, we received it beautifully. Uh, it's it's opened, I think, a week ago. Uh, till now, uh, the, the responses are as well for everybody from the industry, from the people who work. So it first. Uh, Adore the film, like it. Um, the, the law, I think, to my opinion, most people know that the, 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 the religion law, uh, that this is the situation religiously. Uh, but, uh, but when you give life to the world and you see the suffering of one person, uh, it makes it uh, vivid. Uh, the situation. So, so far we received it very, very nicely. We, we got the, the first award of the best film in, in Israel. We received beautifully in festivals uh, all over the world. Uh, the film is distributed in many countries and starting now. And uh, we're hoping it will be uh, it will, it will have a nice response from, from the audience all over the world. Um, as far as I know, uh, it's opened uh, in Israel the last week, and till Saturday there's no, it's, it's uh, fully booked, which is a good sign. Y esperamos verlo, esperamos verlo como uno de los films eh, finalistas en los Oscars. Well, we hope so too. Uh, anyway, we are representative of, of the Israel cinema to the Oscar. We uh, hope uh, we'll be accepted by the uh, American Academy also. Y terminando, ¿qué eh, usted cree personalmente que las costumbres deben ser más actualizadas conforme al tiempo? Do you think that customs should be up to date? I mean, should be um, according to the, our times, so, so customs should be adapted to modern life? Um, for sure, I, I agree with you completely. Uh, I think customs has to, to evolve all the time. Uh, one of the things that, that was good in Judaism uh, traditionally, 
as the, the, the Jewish laws uh, accustomed themselves uh, through the centuries. Unfortunately, it doesn't happen in, in modern Israel. Uh, there is so much power of the religious uh, politics uh, uh, that became uh, rigid and not, not changing. I think eventually uh, the, the customs uh, uh, of religious customs will, will have to change because people can't leave this world for, uh, for a long time. Uh, first of all, there was um, many years that Israel has to uh, you know, establish itself as, 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 as a country. Uh, and, uh, religion and, and, uh, and nationality in Israel is sometimes one thing. Uh, but uh, I think as Israel establishes itself as, as a country, a free country, safe within itself, uh, I think uh, um, also the religion has to to adjust itself to the new Israel. Uh, it's only hopes uh, at, the, uh, at the moment, uh, but uh, you have to start with something. Le voy a decir es tres palabras y que me si me puedes responder lo primero que le vean a la mente. She's going to tell you three words, so please just say what these words say to you very quick. First of all, movies. America. Theater. Uh, Shakespeare. Uh, woman. 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 Penelope Cruz. 